I can't tag Sneepot. Why? Hello. Hello. We have a special Hello. guest today. Uh, it's Nama. And we also have Davi. <laughs> He's also special. Yeah, like always. <laughs> yes. Um, uh, oh, my God. Why I cannot tag Sneepot? And if somebody Sneepot. don't know Nama, but maybe it's somebody who is... Nama is the uh, very special guest. Uh, she is the person who likes very girlish, pinky, and glitter <laughs> things. Then you know. Yeah, shabby cheek <laughs> and traditional scrapbooking. Yeah, uh, I try to in Polish. Uh, witajcie wszyscy. Dzisiaj naszym gościem jest Nama. Uh, Nama jest na głównym ekraniku, więc Asiu to nie Olga. To są e, skrzydełka na tył mięce od Namy. E, jeśli ktoś nie miał okazji e, widzieć projektów Namy, e, to polecam serdecznie, szczególnie e, kanał na YouTube, gdzie ostatnio Nama od jakiegoś czasu tworzy bardzo e, fajną, miniaturową posiadłość e, w takim Halloweenowym klimacie, więc e, krok po kroku każde pomieszczenie ze schodami, z kominkiem i wszystkimi potrzebnymi elementami, więc jeśli macie ochotę zobaczyć, to e, koniecznie zajrzyjcie na YouTube. Ja za, wam zaraz za chwilę wrzucę linka. Jest i w opisie. Tam... Proszę? Jest w opisie. I A, jest w opisie, się okay. peculiar. Tak. Okay. Now, uh, Nava, you can you can speak. You can speak uh, over David. Otherwise, we will not shut up. Never, ever, ever. <laughs> yeah, I know. I don't have the turn off button on my back. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Um, so, what, what's the plan for today? I'm copying the YouTube link, and yep, it goes over here. Yeah, perfect. I, I can't really hear you very well. I don't know if you can hear me okay, but yeah. I'm hearing a lot of noise when you speak, like a very electronic noise. I don't know if others have that issue or if it's just me. When I speak. Sorry? Yes, when I speak. Okay, so we have to I don't wait. know, but I hear you both uh, perfectly. Yeah, I hear well as well, but I I always hear myself well. Okay, let's change it. Uh, yep, yep, it should be. Yeah, we have uh, from Christiana information, no issue. Okay, so it's just me. <laughs> okay. Yes. Um, okay, well, I'll try to figure it out so I can actually hear you. So it's just, so it's just me. It's just me. Yeah. Thank you, everyone. everyone. Uh, okay, so I will need to probably bring earphones. So I'm going to run off and bring them and be right back, okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, so let's make a switch. Uh, in the meantime, because uh, uh, I wanted to make something, but uh, today I'm all over the place. And so I decided to go with something simple. And I will assemble another <laughs> MDF coffin, but uh, for a change, I decided to play with uh, with some fun texture. Um, and I ran a Sneepot stencil, this one, and mine is a little bit abused because uh, it's one of the oldest, uh, oldest stencils that I own. And it's a wood grain, you can see me part, and it's even signed, so and that would not get <coughs> misplaced during the classes. And I have two sheets uh, that I uh, run with that texture. And we will just uh, cut it into planks and then put on the coffin and then uh, do some nice paint job over it. And it seems like every Halloween I do assemble one of those coffins. So I think it's a nice tradition and ritual. And uh, I need my rituals <laughs> to maintain um, semi-madness 
eight <laughs> instead of complete madness. So yeah, let's let's do it. Uh, oh, you have and... the comment. Olga is the coffin queen. <laughs> of course, I am. A Asia yeah. pisze, że możesz zacząć malować. Będę tak mieszał języki trochę. Okay, uh, I understand them both, but I have <laughs> issues with switching between them. Okay, okay you are back. Uh, so let's put so... you. Oh, now it's better. Hi. We hear you, Nama. So just let me know if you can hear me okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> I think so. Can you hear me okay? Yes. Awesome. So we're good. Okay. okay. So the last thing that I have are tiny magnets that I okay. dig out uh, from um, papers that he used okay. to roll the cigarettes. I'm 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 back. I think I was just having like a bit of a lag or something. It was weird, um, it, but it'll be fine. It'll uh, be fine. If it's possible, if you want to, you can exit and enter the studio again. Uh, but I don't think it will fix anything. It's just uh, social media acting out a lot lately. Yeah, I don't know. I think that there was something before. Uh, I'm not sure what it was, but now I can hear everything fine and everything is fine. So. Hey, I'm cool. Let's do this. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> so I took one of the, I'm also doing a coffin, as you can see. I took one of these, uh, the little chipboard ones. And I built it ahead because it would have taken me forever to do it live. So, um, and I did, uh, so I used, this is also a sniff art stencil. Mm -hmm. This one, it's gorgeous. Um, so I did some texture paste, um, and yeah, so this is the, the front that, uh, basically, so I had this, uh, it's one of the steam goddesses, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Um, and it wasn't, it, I think it got like damaged. It's, it, Olga sent it to me just to be, uh, uh honest. When, um, I was, and I, when I was packing it, it was uh, a complete piece. <laughs> Just, no, just okay, so no, no, let's be, let's be honest, uh, uh, completely honest, it, it had a few, like, scratches, and it annoyed me, so I broke it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I mean, I don't it. think, you would have to be, like, very, very, I don't know what you would have to do to the parcel to make a resin piece break like that, so no, so I broke it on purpose to make it look, well, like this. Um, <laughs> like the old one. Yeah, so Based. it's like a an old uh, archaeological find. Let's call it that. Yeah. And my aim today is actually to have. Uh, my plan is to have lights inside, <laughs> and to have this like opened a little bit, um, mm -hmm. so the light will come out and that it will be hanged. So, I'm actually going to start with working on. Uh, a vellum piece that's gonna sit inside and hold the um, light inside and diffuse the light and stuff. And um, then I'm gonna color everything and hopefully I'll somewhat finish. But I okay. see you put the spider web around it. With... Oh yeah, yes, I did put the spider webs around it to have some more details. And this is also, uh, I think that's a Zuri mold, right? Yes. The wings. Yeah. yeah. So that was a complete butterfly and I cut it in the middle to have the two uh, pieces. And I think that's about it. Okay. So my... During your will be painting, I try to translate for the Polish. Oh, yeah. Polish. Go ahead. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, Nama będzie używać naszej małej trumienki z tekturek. To, to akurat chyba już się domyśliliście. Natomiast jej pomysłem jest zrobienie takiej e, uchylonej trumny ze światełkami w środku. Stąd będzie doklejać jeszcze e, kalkę techniczną. E, natomiast przygotowała sobie trumienkę wcześniej, posklejała ją, e, dodała dookoła e, wzór e, z pajęczyny. Na bokach są skrzydełka z foremek od Zuri. 
Natomiast na wierzchu połamała foremkę, to jest primowa bodajże z tych takich steampunk queen, jeśli dobrze pamiętam. Godne, goddess. Steampunk to... Goddess? Um, no Steampunk, Albo steampunk Goddess. Queen. Coś takiego, taka troszkę egipska. E, tak by to wyglądało na takie znaleziska archeologiczne. To tak, tak chyba pokrótce. Nic chyba nie pominąłem. Nie, nic oh. nie pominąłeś. <laughs> yeah. And uh, so just last thing is that what I'm going, what this piece is actually um, it comes with the uh, coffin. It's supposed to be, I think, glued down here and then the lid sort of fits inside. I think so, it goes on top, but I'm not sure. You can. I don't know, because it, it fits exactly this size. So I guess that like, if you want it to be like with a lid that, you know, that holds, then... Yeah, but, but in the set, it's uh, it was uh, like uh, the frame on the top on the coffin. Echo. Okay, well, then I'm lying. <laughs> no, you are But not. Anyway, uh, it will fit both ways. Yeah. It fits yeah, like that. So basically what I did is that I glued it to a piece of vellum and now I'm going to um, make, like, cut around this in a height that it would fit exactly in here and sit inside. Yeah. That's yeah. my mm -hmm. purpose. Done. Explained. Yeah, okay, it's no problem. Na map wybrała tą ramkę, która normalnie jest na wierzchu, ale pasuje też równie dobrze w środku, jako taki dodatkowy zaczas, więc jeśli przykleicie to pod, pod wieczkiem trumny, to będzie fajnie, idealnie pasowało i zamykało trumienkę, jeśli ktoś woli w tej formie trumnę. Natomiast to fajnie przytrzyma tą kalkę, jak na mają założy i zrobi teraz obecnie ją dookoła z, takim, z taką zakładką, bo przypuszczam, że skrzydełka będą wpuszczone do środka, żeby to wszystko się lepiej trzymało i, i było schowane. Uh, we have comments from Mixed Media Arts and Crafts. Those wings work so well on their Nama. Thank you, Anthony. Yep, Anthony. Oh, it's Anthony. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Thanks so much. Oh, not knowing the YouTube name. Oh, I am with the old one. I, I have the, you know, uh, gaps in my memories. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dementia is your favorite <laughs> excuse lately. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hello, Karen. Welcome. Hey, Karen. Okay. So, uh, I managed to stick my coffin to, to my table. That's always Can useful. Can show you Olga for a moment? Yes. It's, it, it's more it, interesting than what I'm doing now. It's still nothing. I just assembled uh, my annual coffin. And uh, to be fair, I didn't realize that this one fits so nice inside. And I might use it because uh, I always put it on top to have um, an extra frame Yeah. on, uh, on the lid. Uh, I mean, but... cool is it? I never thought, like, I, I honestly, it's like, it's one of those things because I, you know, on mine, I didn't really have uh, a picture. So I was just like playing with the pieces and I just figured that's what, how you use it. So I don't think you yeah. come with the picture. Wait, I'm looking. No, yeah, there is a picture. Okay. Yeah, yeah but that's because that's the MDF and that's uh, back on the, the little chibi ones. But yeah, you know, this one. it's a cool idea because uh, without that, you we never think about it. Uh, we can use it that like the extra thing to close the the coffin. Yes, yeah, uh, since now I will use it like that. Yeah. I feel, uh, you know, less stupid. <laughs> you should. It's a, it's a really good <laughs> observation that will help yeah. me line up my magnets because. Uh, I really like my idea with magnet closure, but I didn't know how to line them up, and now I know. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'm actually, uh, um, you know, great minds uh, think alike, as they say, because I'm going to use magnets as well, because I want to be able to actually... Well, if I'm putting lights inside, I want to be able to reach them and get to the batteries, so... I wanted the coffin, like the lid to be um, 
to be removable. So we'll see how everything goes. And that's, that's uh, very stra strategic thinking because usually I will forget about the fact that it's cool to have the access to battery packs. So most of my light up works are like one one time thing. When the battery is dead, it's like mm, just a yeah. Piece. It just no happened to me too often that I forget to you know I put the light on, and then I forget to turn it off, and it just stays there. And like after you know like a, a, a night or something, like the batteries are finished, and then just like oh. I need to replace it. So it just happened to me too often that I had to replace them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have comment from Christiana. I just started a, a, a coffin too. I really because need it's to a good coffin it. season. <laughs> yeah. That's our girl. Now everyone wants to have her uh, own coffin. Yes. Yeah, because, you know, that's, that, that's important to... Uh thing in the life to, to, to have nice coffin, you know, then you go out with the bang. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, I will just paint everything beige, beige brownish with, uh, let's see, cappuccino. That seems like mm -hmm. okay color. I think it's enough. Uh, it's oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. A clean brush. Yeah, that that's everything for today, guys. I'm done. <laughs> no, I'm done. I'm a real artist. It's abstract. Uh, yeah, it's, it's very abstract. And now full screen, the, I'm the, smearing brown substance yeah. on the oh, paper. The yeah. Um. No, no, no. It's just watercolor paper. Uh, and I used cream paste with that wood grain stencil. I'm pretty sure that the wood grain stencil is still in shop. I might be wrong, but... Yeah, um, I put the link uh, on, yeah. the, on the chat. Uh, yeah. To może po polsku, Olga. Po polsku. Po polsku, dobra. Więc uh, to, co rozmazuje po papierze, to jest farba w kolorze cappuccino, mimo że tak nie wygląda. Wygląda jakbym się bawiła e, e, błotkiem. <grym> e, mam tutaj nałożoną teksturę z maski e, drewienkowej. E, I drewienkowa maska jest jedną z pierwszych masek, które w ogóle się pojawiły w tym parcie. E, pokazywałam wam na początku moją, jest już strasznie, e, strasznie zjechana. Kilka razy się zapomniała pewnie umyć. Ale strasznie ją, strasznie ją lubię i dzisiaj po prostu był taki dobry dzień na, na użycie maski. A, mamy konkurs. Mamy konkurs dla e, udostępniających. E, więc proszę wszystkich, którzy udostępnią naszą transmisję z, e, na Facebooku. Wybierzemy jakiegoś zwycięzcy i e, dzisiaj może nie będziemy czekać e, do I'm końca happy. programu, tylko damy Wam cały weekend. Na to, to na to. Cały weekend można e, publicznie udostępniać transmisję na Facebooku e, z oryginalnego posta Snipartu. Trzeba udostępnić publicznie na swojej tablicy e, i w niedzielę ogłosimy, w niedzielę wieczorem albo w poniedziałek rano ogłosimy e, kto został e, zwycięzcą i dostanie tajemniczą pakę od Snipartu. Ok, guys, so we will have a, a giveaway today. Um, usually we do the one that you have to stay till the end, but like always, I'm not sure if I will finish my project till Same. the end of live stream. And um, today we will give you the whole week. Uh, whole weekend to share uh, mm, on your timeline the, uh, the post from Snipart Facebook. Uh, so if you watch on YouTube, then you have to log in to Facebook, find a Snipart on Facebook, and just share a live stream from there on your timeline. And we will pick one person, and the announcement will go Sunday evening. Uh, our time or Monday morning. 
so you will have the whole weekend to watch and share and uh, uh, one person will win a surprise pack on Sneepart. Probably spooky surprise pack. Because those are blah, the blah. best. <laughs> yep. Yeah, and we have uh, a, quite a lot of different spooky chibots. I wanted to make the free disc call, but then I decided that we don't have four hours to watch me assembling that life. <laughs> I know. Yeah, I, cool I haven't tried it yet, but I haven't tried it yet either, but it looks so amazing. It just definitely looks like it's going to take a while. So I'm not sure if live <laughs> is the best idea. It's now I of... think that I should raise Davi live with assembly of that. It, uh, it comes with I no instruction. I can't because it was quite easy to put everything together. It's I had the, m more problems with the witch house than with the school, but I don't mm. have the school <laughs> anymore. You wasted yours. Oh, no. Yeah, last year, I made it the project with them. We have them for a whole year already? Oh my god, the time just flies. I make it the school with this shadow, shadow box from Snipper. That's actually true. And Asha <laughs> made an awesome school with the uh, Team Hope's eye in it. It, it was very mm, grungy, yeah. creepy. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. That sounds so awesome. awesome. Yes. It is really awesome. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. the, the really cool project with uh, uh, with that creepy eye. Oh my God. Okay. I love those creepy eyes. They're really cool. I found on Amazon even smaller and more realistic ones. Also with the people, pupil and everything, different colors. And oh my God. Mm. Yeah. It's crazy. To... Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I no. wanted to, to say how crazy it is. Uh, what kind of freaky stuff you can find because they are for doll makers so those are doll eyes they come in different yeah. sizes in different styles and yes. Uh, yes. hi agnieszka hi agnieszka hi agnieszka oh david you didn't get hello it's only hello olga and nama <laughs> yes i know <laughs> you know <laughs> No, I don't know. Say it. Say it. I want you to put yourself in trouble. No, no, no. I don't say that. It's, uh, it's no, dangerous. It's dangerous. Smile and, uh, you know, I will be good boy today. Like always. For a change. Mm. No, 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 no. Yeah, for a change. We know. <laughs> So, um, no, I didn't. I was very focused on jesoing my <laughs> coffin. I didn't realize that I'm on the big screen. No, uh, now but, no one can see anything because it's all black. <laughs> but you know, you putting gesso is still better than me putting the paint in that shade. And I didn't put it through. I should go with the black wood grain. <laughs> But uh, Nama, it's visible. We see the texture of the spider okay, web. Then. Good. That's good. But since I'm on the big screen, I have a question for you. Because I have different options of lights. What do you mm. think we should go with? We can have malevolent red, sinister green. Oh. <laughs> and it's nice or color. like eerie purple so the these are the options purple 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 purple, <laughs> purple 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 oh i don't I, yeah okay and i can't see the comments so um david can totally cheat <laughs> i muted him for a while so he couldn't scream for <laughs> But yeah, so uh, honestly, I don't really care because I can always change the color later. It's true, but uh, 
I always buy a white one because I if I need to change the color, I will use alcohol ink. Yeah, I do the same basically, but then, you know, I just found this um, variety pack of different colors and some colors like red, you don't see how good this red is on. Okay, because we, yeah, uh, uh, you know, when we like, talk... look at that, look, this is like really dark, Wait. awesome red and it's really hard to color to this kind of shade. So I. Oh! Yeah, I want At to least. show off my purchase because I bought ooh, a ooh. pretty short LED uh, stripe. Oh. I paid four free euros for it. Wait, I have to turn off the light. No, that is, I mean, that is, that is a really, ooh, it changes colors too. Yeah, you can set up any color you want and you can make it uh, do fancy stuff like this one when it fades. And you can speed it up or slow it down. So, you know. That's really cool. Yeah. 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 I, yeah. And I'm super, super happy with that free euro purchase. Yeah, that's, you know, uh, finding something cool is awesome. Finding something cool that is also cheap is always better. Yeah, it's one of the, the best finds. Unfortunately, it's only uh, 12 inches of the length. Uh, I'm using it as my side night, uh, side light. Oh my god, side night, side huh? light for for now. Because uh, I lost my big stripe. I don't know. I have ten meters or so of that LED tape that streamers use to make the room, you know, look fancy. Because I wanted to go uh, around the space above my desk, hmm. and I bought it, and nobody knows where it is. Okay. Uh... <laughs> The, the people on, on chat help you, Nama. Uh, Christiana said yes. purple, Agnieszka said red, and Anthony said all of them. <laughs> Thank you, Anthony. That's really helpful. <laughs> all of them is just one level below rainbow, and uh, rainbow <laughs> is very uh, not Halloween y. <laughs> Well, and not also, a coffin friendly uh, color scheme. This in this coffin, only one of these can fit, to be honest. So I'll just, uh, but you know, um, you can put all use the hammer. <laughs> I always said, if you have problem, use the hammer. Uh, that's how we sometimes that's actually helpful but not this case <laughs> that's what i will advise you david next time when you will have a crafty issue use the hammer <laughs> yeah, but okay. you have problem with me i don't know that always and never you know it depends it depends how you behave <laughs> define problem the, yeah also <laughs> Yeah, Anthony okay. wrote, uh, okay. yeah, we don't need any rainbows on this show. Nope. Okay. Nope. Just gonna... Not with the coffin. Coffins and rainbows don't click. Mm -hmm. Not today. Not today. Yeah. I mean, I've tried rainbow lately, and it wasn't even so bad, but... Mm -hmm. You know, I tried it. I done it. I um. That's I can once it. was enough. Yeah, you can move on. Yeah, exactly, exactly. I have one jaw, and and it's perfectly fine. David, you don't have to put me on full screen because for now I'm just like. Yeah, I saw that, and I changed it again. I'm just heat drying the piece of the cardstock with the texture on it. Anthony wrote, <laughs> "I am on your side, David." Well, Anthony, I don't know what, what me and Olga are thinking of that, but you know, that's okay. <laughs> I, I really? smell conspiracy. Rainbow Some kind of male supremacy. No, no. Well, I do agree with rainbows being very yesterday. We can move on. Yeah. We miss the rainbow, man. You know, every uh, rainbow it's beautiful, especially this rainbow when you cover them uh, with black gesso. Oh, that! <laughs> I I'm so surprised that David is so against the rainbow because 
I always assume, he always says that he likes all the colors, so I would assume that he would like rainbow. It turns that uh, rainbow is the one color that he dislikes. So. Well, I think that there's a difference between liking all colors and liking all colors together. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just, you know, I'm just trying to uh, sneak uh, some some of the David dislikes in the case that he was. Um, um, yeah, you, you do need to challenge. collect those. Yeah, in case that he will be our challenged person again. Okay. Yeah. So, After Olga with the real two butterflies. Uh, no, no, I, I don't think. Um, I will bring that paper from the doctor that says that I don't, I don't go I, for challenges. But, you know, I don't will be a push you for the uh, for the green color. You need only make the project with the 52 uh, butterflies. Unfortunately, I think that we will have to have the rule that the challengers cannot repeat themselves. Mm -hmm. So if you want to see the butterfly or the green, then you have to unfortunately reward the previous one. Oh my God, I'm so clever today. I'm so clever. Okay, so the plan is to make uh, planks from it. I could use my guillotine or something like that, but of course I'm I'm too lazy for that. So I will just use the ruler and hope for the best. I knew you'll understand me, Penny. By the way, uh, yeah. what Penny said because I didn't see the comment. It's, I uh, it's, uh, exactly Nama. I love all colors as well, but not in one huge collage. Um, yep. And is Anthony Penny the one that you, we are said, sending the glitter bump to? Yeah, Anthony, yeah, she's the one. Anthony asks you, you have a plan, Olga? Um, plan what for kind what? Of plan? Uh, plan a health for life, plan? Yeah, plan I, have quite, I have quite nice health plan. Thank you for asking. It covers dental as well. So I'm very happy. Mm. But if you are asking if there is a plan, actually, uh, we are reaching the point that uh, my pre-planning has uh, run out because the only plan I had is a wooden coffin. So, uh, yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, Antony, add craft plan. Craft plan. No, no. The, unfortunately, not today. And uh, Penny wrote, darn you, Olga, stop treating me with glitter. <laughs> I didn't send a single glitter bump to you yet. Yeah. And Leah, Leanne wrote, cześć, David, cześć, Olga. Ooh, Leanne is practicing her Polish. The next thing, it will be like like Sam when she used the Google Translator and she said that yeah. she, li she likes to lick nail polish. What? Um, I've I obviously missed want, something to have some. Uh, we were having a po one of the Saturday Polish lives, and mm. obviously she wanted to say that she likes to hear us uh, speaking Polish, but the Google Translator uh, had a very fun day, so it translated for her, I like to lick nail polish. <laughs> she just typed it in the chat. Well, yeah. you know, that is very private information. I don't think that Google should translate that. <laughs> I don't think it's also healthy. And nope. the end, that's uh, definitely uh, true. Oh, hello, Nama. Hello. Okay. It's a good okay. thing that it's a small coffin. I might actually finish just doing today. <laughs> But, you know, with the small ones, I always feel like I have to add more and more and more. So if I go with the big one, and lately mm. I decided that instead of doing something out of this world and, uh, you know, mind-blowing, mm. it's better to go simpler and be more focused on, on the process itself because mm -hmm. I tend to go in a very weird and time-consuming space very fast. Yeah, I get it. I mean, I, I think that, <laughs> yes, you know me. <laughs> I knew that 
I knew that you would understand. Uh. Yeah. I just think that, you know, honestly, um, it's been a while since I did, like, a mixed media project. Like, well, I mean... No, your you house is one... Yeah, but it's yeah. one big mix, big mix media project. It's so yeah, many that's true. Cool techniques. It's true. I mean, miniatures are like are mixed media, but it's a different type or something. I don't know. I just also it was just one of those things that I I knew I want. I I decided I wanted to do the little coffin, and then I was looking through the things, and you know, it's one of those. Ooh, wouldn't it be cool to have the wings? Ooh, if I'm putting wings, wouldn't it be cool if it's like hanging? Ooh, wouldn't it be cool if it'll be lighting? That's just you know. And then we one arrive thing led at the. Uh, at this stage when you think oh it would be cool if you would make it move and I think last year yeah last year yeah. I did uh, a coffin and basically when I was watching you live and you explained that you want to do the dancing people I was like no it will not work out you know I already did the whole project mm. Christiana did I believe two projects during the live yes and you were still figuring out mechanics and I but it like, did nah, work. It will. I I was convinced that it will not work. And when when uh, it turned that it does work, I was like, oh, wow, <laughs> mind blow. <laughs> okay, so on there the was sides, success in the end. <laughs> on the sides, I want to have more narrow planks, and the easiest way Ooh, is to nice. go uh, with the whole plank around. Zgadaliśmy okay, się troszeczkę po angielsku. Były to, były to rozmowy o jakichś takich naszych zawiłościach z Google Translatorem oczywiście, pomiędzy dwoma językami, bo to tak różnie bywa. I, i, i że tak powiem, wróćmy teraz do tego, co Olga robi, bo z tego, co widzę, to będą to deski na trumienkę. E, tak, więc e, pociąłam sobie tą teksturę na takie e, paseczki. Tutaj nie wszędzie mi się wymaskowało, więc e, muszę je poprzycinać e, teraz tak, żeby, e, żeby wyłożyć mi boczki i na boczki potrzebuję w miarę wąskie te deseczki i staram się je przemieszać, e, tak żeby mi się nie do końca pokrywała ta tekstura na, na tych boczkach. Dobra, przytniemy sobie kubeczki. Okay. I teraz tak, potrzebuję kilka, chyba dwie albo trzy, to zobaczmy raz. Kurczę, mogłam w sumie użyć linijki, to zmierzyć byłoby... No bo chyba teraz trzy ci nie wejdą. Wejdą, tylko ten jeden trzeba trochę przywęzić, będzie gi. Będzie pani zadowolona. Tak, ten jeden muszę troszkę zwęzić. Gdzie są moje nożyczki, które ładnie tną? Cześć Aniu, witaj. Hej, hej! A gdzie są moje nożyczki, co ładnie tną? Gdzie są moje nożyczki, co ładnie tną? Nie wiadomo. In meantime, Anton wrote, Nama is alive with ideas on fire. You know, there's smoke at least. <laughs> and Lian wrote not to pressure you, Olga, but Nama it's way ahead. Just saying. I'm oh actually not. My <laughs> God. The audacity. I think Liana, you're trying to start a fight. I mean, like what what what? No. No, she just uh, she just she's just to teasing. Rush me. I know. Yeah, she just want to rush me, uh, rush me up. Yeah, but I will. I'll, I will just say that. I mean, how am I ahead? I put gesso on it. <laughs> so there's not. Yeah, I don't. I didn't put the gesso on it. I know not that I'm planning, <laughs> but I, I do. Me too. I I I hope so, because you know, every time when I decide, like, nah, it turns that I should. No, I actually don't me... think that, like, in this case, because you're gluing the paper on it, right? So I think it's actually gonna, like, it's gonna might actually catch better without the gesso. Sometimes the gesso kind of makes everything too smooth for the glue. Actually, you are right. So I, I, uh, I will stop overthinking that because I think that that's the thing that Lian wants to 
cause me overthinking and just having a, a stupid mistake that I will have to uh, recover from because uh, well you know way... it's entertaining for the audience <laughs> <laughs> of course it is uh, we have conversation, Penny Broad. Where are you there for that life, Liam? Liam Broad. At least we can guarantee neither will finish. <laughs> and Penny <laughs> said, <laughs> OMG, Liam, just because you do 23.7 projects and everyone else only gets one finished. Now I feel <laughs> challenged because actually, uh... Lien is late, so she missed the part that I said that I'm planning to actually finish the project for a change. Um, so I will just speed up and I will surprise everyone. To be fair, it's not a very complicated thing. Yeah, we just put the paper on top of NDF. No, no, no uh... Olga, it's sneaky. I think she has the ready coffin under the table and when we don't. Yeah, watch, in my secret the pocket. Switch to project and it'll be, I finish. <laughs> no, yep. I just, it's a camera I just, trick. I just think that this one will be not super time consuming. Uh, Penny brought no fair for Lien to challenge anyone. <laughs> Why? No, it is fair. It is fair. It would be unfair if she would not disclose that she's a speedy crafter, but we know that she is. So taking advantage of your advantages is not cheating. It's just being smart. Just just saying, in the defense of that, the freaking two one butterfly that David seems not to be able to let go that I tricked his <laughs> clever system. <laughs> That I'm wasn't coming. cheating. That was just being smart. I, I, no, I honestly, not. I'm sorry, David, but I think that that was two butterflies. How you place no, them? It's... One double and not that. Oh one, my two. God! You what is what? double? What does double mean? Double means two. I mean, come on. No, it was. You know one, what? One butterfly oh. with double power of the wings. <laughs> Nothing more. Because because every time you argue about that i will have to put or oh, uh, download the footage from the from that stream and every time when you will argue that that was just one butterfly i will play you out loud when i'm asking you do you see two butterflies yes do you agree that those are two butterflies yes you did agree you did confirm <laughs> it was a magical moment <laughs> Witamy szefową na pokładzie. Marta dołączyła do nas. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Marta was fixing the laser. Yes, yeah. that that is important part of, um, of the process to keep them working. Mm. We need a lot of coffins. <laughs> okay. Okay. So for coloring. Uh, Penny wrote, uh, Lian sneezes and that produces a new finished project. <laughs> Penny is just jealous. Because I would love to have that uh, uh, productivity. Because in my head, I can wink, you know, 10,000 projects. And then I start to, ooh, that would be cool. Ooh, that would be cool. And yeah. it end up with a never ending struggle. Yeah, and you have in your. Uh drawer a 25 unfinished project and uh, you have idea for 10 again uh, next uh, cool project yeah and you won't start at this new one because they are amazing and you can uh, forget what you want to make and it's not a drawer now it's a box when you were here yes it was a drawer now it's a box and there is not 25 probably there is less like 24. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. This now I'm all, almost finished. Oh my God. 
<laughs> but you just say that to stress me out. Like in the competitions, 20 minutes left. 20 minutes left. <laughs> well, I have to give up my apron. <laughs> Who want apron from Olga? I have a couple. I can share. <laughs> I'm not using a single one at home. I use them only when I teach classes. Because usually then I will also wear my going out clothes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Okay. So um, for coloring, oh, let's put it this. I want to try and use these sprays. Uh, those are up, 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 up. No. Oh, my casting. Yes. So now I need to choose which color. Do you have black? Uh, no. Oh, how come? Not the my, What's the, sold out? Ones, there is a gray that is very nice. It'll be silvery, so. Um, there is... Okay, I'll just... There's Don't tell green. me that, Kim. Yeah, this nice is green. Uh, no. This stain. No, no, no. <laughs> There's this, guys. Show this one. Why you hide it? It's nice shade of the green. Really nice. But, it is. Uh, but I think that Nama did the uh, super green project last year. That was uh, black and green, the uh, bottle with the skulls that I'm still jealous it's and kind not, of obsessed. I mean, with... there's like so little green on it, but okay. Um, but it's very green. That little green that it's yeah on no it, it's like... it's um it's a super green that is very true it's like acidic crazy green I like so... I like that setup that you have in your hand right now All I like them? that color combo yeah okay um yeah that's an... did not that, I mean cool. uh remember that putting yellow and purple next to each other can give you <clears throat> nice uh, poo brown yeah. So I'm not sure. I might um, let's play with it and see how it goes. I might start with like you know the basic kind of brown and gray. Have you tested you can, them yet? Or is it? Yes, yeah. I did, but not on this kind of. Um, oh, okay. You can yeah. add the purple and later the green lights inside. Exactly. Um, we can just keep green, you know, like. I think that uh, in the times of sarcophagus, uh, there would be no green because it would be very hard pigment to get. So probably blue, yeah, the, gold. Um, in the time of sarcophagus, they also didn't put butterfly wings on them. So. <laughs> we don't know that. <laughs> okay, Anton wrote, Nama, you do have a rainbow after all. Oh, no. Almost, but I'm not using them all together. That's the point. No, uh, somehow, um, you know, black and gray didn't make to the rainbow cat. Only the bright colors did. So, yeah, uh, it's very yeah, sad. We have, to, we have to advocate for minorities, you know? I know. Black team. Black little <laughs> team. Okay. It's just taking a while to shake it. But, um, yeah, shake, so shake, this shake, guy, shake, <laughs> <laughs> let's see how it goes. Okay, I'm still putting planks on the coffin. I mm -hmm. feel like little wood carpet, a uh, little wood it's carpet. Very shiny. Um, um, you can't uh, see it, but. Here, if I'll pick it up. Can you see how shiny this is? Ooh, nice, nice shade this, of shimmer. Yeah, it's still wet, so look at that. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> and, and we you have completely angel forgot. On the paper. Oh, <laughs> yeah, the, the, the coffin angel shadow. <laughs> yep. <laughs> we forgot about Polish, David. Oh, yeah. Uh... Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Because e, I am very, you know, watching e, the tak. e, Dawid, się, Dawid się zapatrzył tutaj na błyskotki. E, tak. To wezwanie z różowym brokatem sprawiło, że teraz Dawid jest błyskotkowy. A, mm. Więc tak, e, ja sobie dalej naklejam te deski i w tym nic się nie dzieje z moją pracą jeszcze, e, poza faktem naklejania desek. E, Do jutra skończy, na... nie martwcie się. A natomiast mama użyła nowych sprayów od Tima, tych, które mają w sobie majkę um, i widać jak, jak cudowny taki złoto-brązowy połysk się pojawia. Tutaj na dole będzie czarny. Um, I generalnie skupiliśmy rozmowę na, na kolorach, bo Dawid znowu z jakiegoś powodu stara się przepchnąć zielony na Halloween. Kto to słyszał? Najlepsze Ale połączenie. Chciałam Wam przypomnieć, że mamy konkurs spośród wszystkich, którzy udostępnią naszą dzisiejszą transmisję u siebie na Facebooku. Przez Z niepartowego Facebooka wybierzemy kogoś, kto wygra nagrodę. Macie na to cały weekend tym razem. Więc przez cały weekend można udostępniać i w niedzielę wieczorem albo w poniedziałek damy znać, kto wygrał. Tak. I, I pana kotka napisała, ależ te motyle skrzydła są cudne. Jest to, jest to z foremki złowi motyl, taki bogato zdobiony, stąd, stąd takie są. Freedom. Mm -hmm. Magda napisała, fajnie wygląda. Then we have comment Nama, it's cool looking. Thank you. And it's with us, it's the, oh my god, i i don't want to roxanne i use only that thing hello everyone uh, you cannot and... you cannot read the the name it's uh who did the shimmer shimmer i think it's the french yes it is french then i don't want to <laughs> offend <laughs> anyone with your french <laughs> i get it <laughs> But that's the part of the fun, you know. Um, is it pronounced? Actually, especially for you. Especially actually, for you. Actually, for a lot of people, uh, you know, especially my mispronunciations are the source of, of great joy in life. And I don't mind at all. <laughs> that is cool. Yeah. Okay. I like how this came out. I like it as well. Yeah. Just uh... like one spritz. Roxanne wrote, uh, Roxanne, it's most simple. Roxanne is a very beautiful name, too. So, right. you know, yeah. that too. Yeah. <laughs> it was think or police. Uh, police, I think, but yes. <laughs> okay. I think it was, I mean, I think that the song, the Roxanne came out when they were still the police, but I'm not sure. And it's not a creepy song like many of their other songs that were not meant yeah. to be creepy, but ended up being creepy. So, you know, yeah. like uh, like the one about the stalker that is uh, always one of the yeah, most I'll be popular. watching you. Yeah, that's the, the song that is usually popular on weddings and stuff like that. And it's so really? creepy. It's popular in weddings? OK. That's yes, people, people make their mm -hmm. wedding then. That song. Okay. That's a choice. <laughs> okay. okay. So. Yeehaw. So the sides mm. are done. I, I'm just letting you know that the I sides are done. Oh. It looks okay, like I, that. Mm. It will show I up better when I uh, make a wash on top. Ooh. You did what? You did what? You did what? No, I'm wondering if you can see the the. I, I use the silver on the bottom part. Can you see yeah, how it caught the spiderweb? Like sparkling. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And I'm honestly not sure if I want to. But color. It's this this brown thing looking very cool, like the rusty. Or I know it's really like it's this kind of bronze. Like old yeah. brass, all bronze color. It's really cool. So it's I'm not sure. It's, 
I will be honest. Like this, so. I watched mm. uh, the stream when team revealed the uh, Mica Express, and I was like, nah, another shimmery spray. Who mm. knew yeah. that? But now I look at your work, and I'm like, hmm. Actually, it's, hmm, I need that's that. the thing. The thing is that it's just, um, you know, there's a ton of, there's actually a ton of mica sprays out there, but um, there's two things. One is that he tends to have the right, like the, the right amount of shimmer that I like because I don't like a lot. And some mica things just have too much mica for me. I want to spray just the wings. And I want um, to. Uh, and also, he has colors that I love. So yeah, yeah, because we'll always amazing. go with them. And I would uh, say, say something. Them. And Olga, you yeah. don't see the green shade, and you, I think you will be loving with this color. Yeah, actually, I think that <laughs> actually not. <laughs> it's a risk. really Take great witch color of green. So yeah. Because only green that I do not mind and even like it khaki army green that gray green you know like the green that David calls not green at all so <laughs> yeah uh, but you know it's uh, different looking on the black or white than yeah I know I'm trying to you know what I'm gonna bring a black piece of paper and spray it with the green so you'll see it. Unfortunately, now you have to make another coffin this time white, so we can have a comparison. <laughs> I'll be back in a sec. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, we look I, on I'm... Olga like sticking the plank on the on the coffin. Yeah, I I I know. I thought it will be quick and easy, <laughs> but it's not. Oh, it's not so easy when you're watching Nama making the floor in this house, this mansion. It's looking only like the easy thing. Uh, yeah, but I was sure that, you know, uh, just covering that with the texture will be the... Um, first of all, it will look very cool. Uh, and I know that it will look very cool. But okay, somehow in my that. head, it was, you know, quite fast. There's also, I mean... Um... There's two, I think that there's actually two greens in the collection because there was the Halloween and the Christmas. I think the Christmas has another one, but I only have the Halloween, um, the Halloween set. Not surprised here? <laughs> no, not surprised. Wait, look at that. <gasps> no. See? No, no, I heard that. <laughs> It needs to dry a bit, but it's really cool. I yeah, it it look, no. <laughs> look on this uh, white paper when it's mixing with the brown. It's looking cool. Yeah. No, it's it needs to green. dry. We can yeah, leave is... without green. I, I, I. I you I'm... like green without green? Yeah. Yeah, I could leave without green in uh, mixed media products. <laughs> I would really be upset if the green would disappear. Uh, entirely because I like green trees, for example. Yeah, Isabella wrote <laughs> that look great. Yeah. We'll let it dry mm. completely and then I'll bring it back. But yeah. I want to remind everyone uh, that if you share the post publicly on Facebook, you will have a chance to win a prize and you have the whole weekend to do so. So even if you watch on replay on Saturday or Sunday, you can sell the way to enter the um, giveaway. So I'm gonna, I, think, I think I'm finished with the sprays. So I'll move the ridiculous amount of papers that I've put around me. But it's always like that. I start with the clean-ish desk and it end up with me surrounded with piles of stuff on both sides. Yeah, I know, totally, totally. Um, it just, I'm actually not sure if you see, I think you actually see better on the black, right? Like if I don't have the white paper, it's actually yeah, the way the better. camera catches. You can, you can see uh, the shimmer much better. 
Yeah, I, like no, I think that it's just the camera on my phone catches, like, if I put a white background, then the contrast, it just reduces, you know, the, uh, the amount of light that it catches. And wait, when I'm putting tip, black... If you want to change that, you have to turn off the auto white balance in your camera, then it will not change so much. But I won't do that now during the light. So for this... But to be fair, I would this. not... I would not do it because you mostly use that black surface. So if you turn off the white balance, everything will. Uh, will yeah, be exactly. Needed. So, okay. Yeah. Okay. Now we are flipping the deck and I have to trim the exit. So, okay. One more thing that I want to. So I want to add at the. I've put like tiny little holes that for now I can't see, but I will find later at the top and the bottom. At the top, I'm going to put like a, a little hook or something that you can have a string from. And I want to have uh, something dangling like from the bottom, like a chain a with bit. a dangly bit, a chain with this guy that I think I will add a little drop of uh, red on it just for the fun of it. Uh, yeah. And some bones. Where are my bones? Really cool Christmas tree decoration. <laughs> it would be, yeah. Yeah. I I would say that it would be nice uh, window decor. You know, to hang it in the window, yeah. so it just yeah, that's Ooh, true. And maybe a little bell, so it will be like a uh, wind whistle. Oh my God, how are they called? Um, uh, wind chimes, uh, I think. Uh, you know what I, I mean? Those. Uh, mm, Empty. Yeah, I think it's yeah. I think it's wind wind chimes, but someone that actually like has English as their mother tongue should tell us. Uh, but we'll go with yours because it sounds very accurate and professional. Szybciutko, szybciutka informacja Nama planuje u góry później dołożyć taki haczyk do powieszenia i na dole zawiesić taki kryształek z czerwonym odrobinę, tak, takie dyndadełko. E, bo ma, ma być to taka wisząca dekoracja i tutaj rozmawialiśmy o tym, że tak, jeśli ktoś bardzo lubi, to, to można tego użyć nawet jako świątecznej dekoracji na choinkę, bo kto, kto zabroni, ale, ale będzie to na pewno fajna dekoracja do powieszenia czy w oknie, czy w jakimś takim fajnym miejscu. Nie chcę mówić, właśnie... ale ja mam kilka, kilka tych strumienek i właśnie tak jak sobie teraz patrzę, to myślę, że e, będą faktycznie świetnymi ornamentami na choinkę. I być może <grym> Mikołaj się wychodzący z trumienki? Nie, po prostu wiesz to zamknięte trumienki. W zeszłym Aha. roku na Halloween z Mateuszem robiliśmy trumienki śmietkowe i Ale wiesz, zrobił to jest fajne, fajne, takie, ja... fajne takie przesłanie, bo się mówi, że choinka ma być takim symbolem też szczęścia, tak? Życia. Więc Uch. temu by nie. Wchodzimy w jakieś głębokie tematy. <laughs> Ona synka ma po prostu przetrwać kocią inwazję. Aha. So, po just before uh, I forget to do that, yeah, yeah. I'm actually taking this little uh, piece of uh, wire, basically, and I'm going to glue it right uh, inside. I'll try to put it in the light. There's a, a little ledge, so I'm going to glue it right under the ledge, and that should catch the magnets. I've checked mm -hmm. before that it actually works, um, but that would be just here on the side, and then I'll be able to kind of glue oh, the coffin okay. Okay. like this. Okay. Uh, yeah, I should have explained uh, that. <laughs> uh, Taki, taki mały myk, który Nama sobie już wcześniej sprawdziła, wklei teraz pod krawędzią trumienki kawałek drutu, ponieważ sama trumienka będzie zamykana na magnesik. Dzięki temu nie będzie trzeba dużo kombinować z otwieraniem, zamykaniem, po prostu będziemy mogli zdjąć wieczko, zapalić światełka i przykleić wieczko magnesem w dowolnym takim układzie, lekko uchylonym, żeby to światło się wydobywało ze środka, więc... Fajny patent na, na zrobienie zamknięcia. Dobra, mi się właśnie skończył klej i nadal nie zamówiłam sobie kleju. Alicja, teraz... Alicja, Alicja tutaj napisała trumienka na choince, mamy emotkę taką, nie wiem, to jest chyba płaczącą. Nie, tak to powiem... jest taki... 
Aha. No kwestia, kwestia, co kto lubi według mnie. Ja zawsze mówię, że niech każdy sobie dekoruje, z czym się mu podoba. Mm. <laughs> I czy umienka ale, nie jest... Yy, ale wiesz co, yy, ja absolutnie rozumiem, że niektórzy mają tradycyjne, ja wiem, ja... tradycyjne podejście i to jak najbardziej jest, jest ok. Nie, nie mówię tego pod kątem złośliwości czy czegoś takiego, po prostu mm-hmm. mówię, że w każdą stronę, co każdemu się podoba, to sobie powiesi. Ja w tym roku mam podejście świąteczne, bardzo tradycyjne, czyli czerwony, zielony, złoty i, i, i w tą stronę. Więc ja, jeszcze nie kupiłam, ja jeszcze nie kupiłam tegorocznej bombki. Z zeszłego roku mamy. W zeszłym roku nie kupiliśmy bombki, bo była pandemia, ale dwa lata temu, tuż przed pandemią, co roku kupujemy jedną ładniejszą, taką ręcznie robioną bombkę. I dwa lata temu wybierał ją mój syn, więc wybrał ogórek. Taki konserwowy. Więc w tym roku jest moja kolej i ja pewnie wybiorę. Nie wiem, co wybiorę, ale coś, coś fajnego z tym, że my ubieramy choinkę bardziej dekoracyjnie niż jakichkolwiek religijnych przesłanek lub pobudek. Mhm. To nie wiem, jak to, jak kleić właśnie ten środeczek, żeby on mi tutaj idealnie pasował. I wydaje mi się, że po prostu wezmę sobie jeszcze jedną trumienkę i odmierzę to. Tutaj mamy komentarz od Izabeli. Trumienka na choince to u nas normalka. Choinki na Halloween ubierają, więc nic nowego. Okej. Okay. Oszukam trochę. To znaczy z kolejnego zestawu trumienkowego wyciągnę sobie po prostu tą ramkę. Potem ją wsadzę z powrotem, żeby mi się nie zgubiło. Już mi się zgubiło. Mama walk with the wire uh, and prepare Yeah. The eyes for the hanging the crystals, I think. Mm-hmm. Yes, exactly. Yeah. It's a little too big, so I'll make it smaller in a sec, but yeah. That's what it is. <laughs> And we had the conversation in the Polish about the uh, Christmas trees decoration. And uh, Isabella wrote its... Uh, Coughing on the tr- Christmas tree in her uh, region, it's uh, totally normal because people prepare the Christmas tree on Halloween. That makes sense. Oh. I mean, if it's already there, then why not put some Halloween decorations on it? It's like yeah. two roasts with one go. Okay. Yay. So I. Uh... I cheated, I opened the other kit and I just uh, made sure that it goes inside. Nice. Yeah. So now we will uh, stick the magnets as well. And where are my magnets? Oh, here they are. I, I mamy komentarz od Alicji. U nas jeszcze chyba to nie norma. Moja mama chyba dostałaby zawału, gdyby zaczęła to na choince. Na choince. Dlatego rozmawialiśmy Alicjo, że to jest właśnie kwestia tego, co kto lubi i, i, i w jaką stronę idzie. U mnie zawsze choinka była bardzo na kolorową. To był chyba jedyny moment, kiedy toleruję tą tęczę taką. To jest, to jest choinka, która ma wszystkie bombki, odkąd, odkąd gdzieś tam były, więc wszystkiego po trochu. No właśnie ja żałuję, że nie zatrzymałam takich bardzo starych bombek, co miałam, bo jak tylko się trafiła okazja, to właśnie o, wymienię sobie wszystkie i będę miała taką piękną, jednokolorową po prostu, jak, jak z filmu, tudzież jak z galerii handlowej, szczerze mówiąc. Ale, ale teraz żeby, nasze... było, żeby było dla wyrównania, to tak trumienka wszystkich szokuje, ale diabła na święta, jak zobaczą, to nikogo nie szokuje. E, diabła? A, jak tak. kolędnicy chodzą. Tak, jak kolędnicy chodzą. U nas nie chodzi na przykład. E, I Su napisała, że w, ognie, w oknie jako um, suncatcher, czyli... E, no właśnie... Um... To są dzwonki wietrzne po polsku. Mm-hmm. Um, 
Mm, oh, ewentualnie in the window łap... it is uh, a sun catcher, yeah. Okay. No właśnie. Właśnie, dokładnie. Okay. A, nigdy nie Nama, nie nama pokrywa, pokrywa kryształek e, tuszem alkoholowym. Czerwony, tak. Tak, e, czerwonym, ale takim e... ciemniejszym z tego, co widzę, czerwonym, takim A. bardziej troszkę krwisto. Tak, ale będzie wyglądać, e, wydaje mi się, bardzo fajnie. Tak. Okej, okay, dobra. Więc tak, ja mam takie małe magnesy, które będą mi się tu musiały wkleić, więc używam e, e, kleju ekstra forte i moje magnesy się składają z takiej małej e, płytki i e, takiego małego cenzelka i mam je z e, opakowań po bledkę do kręcenia papierosów miały magnetyczne zamknięcia i po prostu je powyciągałam. Te magnesy nie są bardzo, bardzo silne, ale ładnie mi tą trumienkę zamkną, z tym, że muszą dobrze wyschnąć, zanim zacznę używać. Więc tutaj wkleję sobie tą dolną część na razie, a górną część po prostu nałożę kropelkę kleju i jak zamknę wieczko, to, to one się przykleją. A teraz sobie zrobię łoż na mojej, na mojej trumience. I mniej więcej będzie już koniec, z tym, że mam jeszcze taki fajny krzyż. To jest akurat odlew z foremki. Jest taki bardzo dekoracyjny, to jest krzyż celtycki. Tutaj w zestawie też jest taki krzyż, ale wydaje mi się, że ten będzie fajniej pasował i chyba zrobię go na złoto, tak mi się wydaje. Tak, Alicja nam najpierw... napisała, że mnie się to podoba, ale muszę dbać o odczucia mojej bardzo tradycyjnej rodzinki. Alicja zawsze od ściany, w kąciku. Dla ciebie będzie wisieć, a nikt nie zobaczy. Mhm. <laughs> Okej, okay. jaki kolor byśmy zrobili? Hmm. Czarny chyba, nie? Olga, Olga szuka koloru do łosza i miesza nie. farbę, natomiast Ty... mama, jak widzicie, powiesiła kawałek łańcuszka już pod spodem, więc już jest prawie gotowa do, do tego przyczepienia kryształu. I think Nama is here, or no? I am here, yes. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I said to, to people from Poland, you, you prepare your coffin with the chain. Yes, I did. Yes, but yeah. <laughs> okay, and let's with the yeah place for the crystal. Yes, it is, and um, well, I put some uh, alcohol ink on the crystal and just hanged it uh, on the side to to dry. So I'll bring it in a, I'll, I'll bring it. Yes, and I just um, I don't want to color all of it. I just wanted it to look like it's dripping. Yeah, like so, the one drip of blood. Is yeah, perfect. so I just had a little bit of dripping and I'm just letting it dry completely. And yeah, and I'm I'm going to add, the, I think, these little bones in the middle as well, but I'm not sure yet. I need to see the crystal because I'm also not sure if I want to... Um, yeah, because those cross bones might bring mm. the, uh, the pirates uh connotation yeah. quite fast yeah i know i mean i can but also I like just, them i like them i might maybe oh oh no just a sec yes maybe if i'll use like not identical bones it's already a little better maybe do you have a different one i mean like there's two sizes oh seriously They were always two sizes or uh... there used to be three sizes. There were oh. tiny ones and he stopped making them and I'm very sad. Uh but yeah, there's two sizes. There's like C. They're a little they're not this I one is a little check, bit smaller. I will have to check my bone collection. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah, if it's not exactly the same size, it's already looking a little less like um pirate's crossbones. But yeah, yeah. yeah on top totally... we have still a discussion about uh, the coffin on the Christmas tree, and uh, Panna Kotka uh, wrote, uh, "The coffin you can always, uh, I don't know, change in the colorful houses, and uh, on Christmas tree don't will be shocked to anybody." 
maybe. I don't know. I know. I mean, it depends on your style, of course, and so on. But uh, I know people that put little coffins on their Christmas tree. Uh, if, if you leave the bottom part and you make this uh, a roof like the triangle, and it will be like the build house or something, not like the coffin. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Okay, I almost done with like faking my wood grain here. I'm trying to avoid any kind of uh, heat heat gunning, but unfortunately, I think we'll have to do some. Okay, let I will let it sit. So for now, it looks like that. Wait, because we lost one of my lights and I forgot to turn it on. Okay. I think it looks quite realistic. Yeah, that looks awesome. Yeah. It looks really good. I love that. Where is where is my cross? Okay, so here is my cross. It's a brand new mold. I'm very excited. That's the first time I'm using it. And mm -hmm. I need a black paint. Okay, let's go with this one. I am adding some dry brush acrylic to my flowers, red, to fit what I've put on the crystal. I wanted um, to put the black paint, but I forgot that my mold was covered with uh, uh, mold releaser, so I will move like this. Oh, here you are. Hmm? Hmm. Okay, so uh, paint didn't want it to stick. You saw that it started to uh, make that little wealth uh, on my resin print. It's because I, uh, like I said, it was quite oily. So I, instead of black paint, I will just use gesso because gesso responds better to oily surface. It will just work perfectly fine. Okay, and I think that my cross will be golden. Mm -hmm. Okay, almost done. Uh, unfortunately, I will have to use the heat gun, and of course, all my hands are covered with everything and let's see if i can still wipe some of the color or we will go with the no i can okay after the paint was sitting there for a while it's not so easy to remove it but i can remove it partially so it will give me a nice natural ish look Oh, that Hi. looks real awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Dla tych, którzy nie byli na początku, bo wiem, że parę osób dołączyło, Olga zrobiła okay. papier akwarelowy, y, przepuściła przez maszynkę, tak? Razem z nie. maską. Nie, nie, nie. Użyłam cream paste. Uh, A, okej, okay, na użyłaś. Myślałem, że przepuściłaś przez maszynkę dla zrobienia, wiesz, kształtu. Y, to nałożyła pastę strukturalną. Na, na papier z maski właśnie tej drewnianej ze snipka. Dzięki temu uzyskała fajny efekt deskowy. No i później było malowanie. Teraz zrobiła jeszcze dodatkowe parę plam i starła to na mokro, żeby zrobić takie Ale taką przecierkę. przecierkę. Tak, bardziej naturalnie to wygląda. Wydaje mi się, że jak zresztą może dołożę jeszcze kilka chlapnięć brązowych. Ale generalnie jestem bardzo zadowolona z tej kominki. Będzie fajnym, Zawsze można dołożyć trochę glonów. Będzie fajnym, fajnym trzymakiem na skarby. Zwłaszcza, że będzie się zamykać na magnesik. Ale i tak, umieszczenie tej ramki w środku, zobaczcie, już pomaga na to, żeby, żeby wieczko właśnie zostawało na miejscu, więc to bardzo fajna obserwacja, którą... Um, ja bym na to nie wpadła, więc e, dobrze, że mam gościa, który mi 
Może podpowiedzieć jakieś fajne rozwiązania. I was just saying that uh, the trick with putting that uh, top element inside of the coffin, it works so nice because, yeah, oh, I will oh. add magnet. But look, the, uh, the, the lid already looks a little bit. So, yay. Nice. Thanks for that. Okay. <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> That's good to know. <laughs> that I'm, I got it right. Yeah. Now I'm the jealous. looks like a real wood. Yes, it does. Yeah, it looks cool. amazing. Uh, Alicjo, uh, nie ma za co. Cieszę się, że się przydał. <laughs> Dziękuję. Co nam się przydało? Co nam się przydało mu? Uh, Alicja napisała, podziękowała za tutek z dyniami, bo zrobiła i wykorzystała to jak dzień się. Miło by się też Alicjo zobaczyć. <laughs> Możesz wkleić link na, na czacie tutaj. Też bardzo, bardzo chętnie zobaczę. Ok. Pozazdrościłam tego, że właśnie koleżanka ma złoty, więc tutaj sobie dołożyłam trochę złotego na, na ten krzyżyk. Będzie wyglądał całkiem spoko. Teraz mnie kusi, żeby go dać odwrotnie, ale... <śmiech> ale się powstrzymam. Ale się powstrzymam, bo jesteśmy na żywo nie. na Facebooku. Facebook nie, nie, już i tak mnie nie lubi, więc nie będę go drażnić. Uh, Olga said uh, she is jealous about your uh, shiny gold thing on your project Nama and she oh. need to add to gold cross. <laughs> yeah. Well, but um, okay. ooh, it's very and nice. It looks, it looks very, very cool and very... Yeah. It looks like really cool, uh, you know, uh, animation prop, because it's not a movie prop, not a re real life-size coffin. But uh, yeah. who knows, maybe that will be my project for the next year, for Halloween. <laughs> real-size coffin. <laughs> <laughs> With maybe the light more than an hour and a half for that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I will need more than one hour and a half. Okay, I uh, I can be done. I can keep on going, but I can be done as well. We are live for one hour and a half. Yeah. How, uh, how is your going? Just a second. Because I'm blowing uh, something. Exactly like that, Olga, it's finished. Uh, don't finish inside, don't finish uh, bottoms <laughs> of the coffin. It's uh, don't listen to her. No, I, I'm I'm finished. I'm actually finished. No, not this time. We don't believe you. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, show um, me your late project and turn it upside down because I want to see all the <laughs> bottoms of your artworks nicely finished. <laughs> but inside the coffin, you have the not finished. Surface. But I can't finish inside okay. until the magnets will. Yeah, yeah. Excuse. Start. Yeah, well, I have much more to finish, but that's okay. Um, so yeah, so I have this crystal that I will add. I think I might shorten the chain a bit. I think this is a bit too long. Maybe I'll put it like this. If you need and... more of the crystals, I think I can send you more of them. So you can have a couple of them hanging from the coffin. But now it doesn't look like a pirate. It looks uh, very cool and awesome-ish. So, um, yeah, I mean, I still need to add more colors and stuff and everything. We do have, so this, I don't want to put it in because um, it will get it's dirty, not complete. Yeah. yeah, but basically this sits inside and per your choice, it will be with purple light, I guess. <laughs> Yay. Okay, we have the comments this. in Polish. The both projects looks awesome and they make oh my god, how it's they impressive. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, Super I'm gonna great Nama. Uh, we have uh, the both look uh, the both look awesome. Um, yeah, and both mm -hmm. is happy as well. That's yeah. uh, that's good, that's good. It's good to keep your both happy. Um, okay, so the plans for upcoming weeks. Next week, 
I'm live probably with David and that will be just before Halloween. So uh, probably again something deadly dead or in coffin or, uh, you know, darker vibe last time this year, unfortunately, yes. sadly. Um, sadly. <laughs> I and know. Then, then we have in November challenge our designer and we have live class. Uh, with the gnome tag and you can find the supply list because it's um, craft along with Marta and I will be crafting along as well as the dummy on the side of the screen so you know I will be the test rabbit how how fast because uh, Marta works really fast and I'm very slow so we figure it out that that's the perfect way to make uh, to make it you know <laughs> for the a good demo life. because it works for all speeds yeah 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 so I will be I will <laughs> be a speed bump for my basically <laughs> that's perfect I'm, uh, so I'm pretty sure that I want to also do a cat bed in the shapes of coffins oh. I already discussed it with uh, Snippard Marta that I would like to have bigger MDF pieces to assemble so the cool. bed uh, yeah but we still work on it because mdf comes in a certain size and you can't go bigger than that on the mm. laser so i'm yeah. afraid i will have to figure it out the whole project on my own but i cannot wait to see my little bevels in their little coffin bed that sounds awesome uh, the oh, coffin yeah. the coffin itself it's one of my very favorite spaces. I made, well, a couple of them. Uh, most of them I gave away. I have only one at home. It's the one that I did last year with Nama and Christiana. And this one, uh, oh wait, mm. this way, this way he will fit. Yeah, uh, I remember it. You finished it. it. You yeah, finished it in the live. I did finish it, and I am so yes. proud that it's standing on on my uh, on my shelf. And now I will have nice jewelry holder. Welcome, to Karen. Um, Karen, come here. Hello, beautiful ladies. Hello, I Karen. Live. Hello, hello. Okay, so uh, I think we will end at that yep. point. I will post. Uh, my project probably by the end of the weekend if I will remember hopefully <laughs> I will <laughs> but no promises will be made remember that you can still share and win a super prize check out all the links in Nama's channels and socials uh, in the description box uh, there is ongoing mansion project um, that uh, you have to subscribe for all the notifications to be notified when it's actually live. And it also still not always happened because YouTube is a... Uh, weird. So Let's just call it weird, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I love it and I do uh, follow along and I watched all the episodes. Uh, and you. it's super cool. And uh, yeah. The, the last, uh, the kitchen... Uh, Think for this heat. I can one. show it if you allow so, me. Yes, yes, of course you can. Uh, it's right tak, behind o, o, me because that's I have a channel on the channel where you can see how it is built. I have a miniature residence. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, Um, no i plan jest taki, że przez e, cały e, październik Nama właśnie buduje elementy. Tutaj mamy militarnik taki, taki e, bardzo taki oldschoolowy, taki. żeliwny. That is so yeah, cool. It. Yeah, it's, oh my god. Uh, uh, Karen, it's me, it's David. <laughs> yeah, and um, yeah, you can see the size. <laughs> Basically. Yeah, it's, it's so cool. It's have amazing. you got, it's tiny. have you mm -hmm. ever used the iron stove like that? Because we had no. it in a holiday house. 
No, I don't. I'm not even sure we ever we have it here. Like I don't. I've never even seen one. Like because it's the one that you put the coil inside. Yeah. Yeah, I know, but yeah. I, think, I mean, I'm not sure because these, like you know, the big ones. Maybe we, I'm assuming we had something like that. You know, 19th century, but I've never seen one here, so we got rid of them. <laughs> A penny broad also oven stove and could be a furnace for burning Freddy Krueger in the boiler room. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, but okay. uh, Alicia wrote you create miracles. No. Oh. You oh. have that comment. Brilliant. Will look wonderful, Nama. It Thank is. You. It is, and the whole mansion is an awesome project. Okay, thank you for joining me today. I hope that it's not the last time that we have you here. It was awesome. Mm -hmm. Like always, I love to creep around with you. Yeah, same here. Same here. I thank enjoy you. every time so much. <laughs> thank you, David, for uh, helping with the uh, with the chat and comments, like my drink of the frame. Um, <laughs> and thank you, everyone, for attending. Remember about sharing for winning. Kochani, dziękuję Wam bardzo serdecznie za to, że przyjście. Dziękuję Dawid i dziękowałam na mnie, że przyszła e, gościć na Sniku, e, ponieważ mamy podobne poczucie estetyki, więc zawsze w okolice Halloween robimy e, sporo różnych e, strasznych projektów. E, dzięki, że przyszliście e, na czat specjalnie, e, zwłaszcza, że wiem, że to taki Śliski temat, nie wszyscy lubią, więc e, dziękujemy za obecność. Pamiętajcie, że jeżeli udostępnicie live stream e, profilu na Facebooku od Sniparku, macie szansę wygrać e, nagrodę, niespodziankę. Okej, okay, to wszystko na dzisiaj. E, Dawid, chcesz coś powiedzieć, czy e, jedziemy z zakończeniem? Ja serdecznie dziękuję za zaproszenie i pamiętaj, że nigdy się nie poddam z e, tym zielonym. Nie będzie tak łatwo. Ha, 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 ha.